Martin, congratulations. What a result for you, beating the defending champion, Rob Cross. Is that the biggest win of your career so far? I think on the television stage, it's my biggest win. I think in this year, my biggest win was on the floor against Gilman Price. It was the seeded number one. But uh, I came here with only one goal. I saw the draw. Okay, I have to play the defending champion. How nice should it be <laughs> to send him home in the first round? That was the only thing I had. And it lost him two weeks ago. Um, so in my preparation, uh, the last couple of weeks, I was already okay. And yeah, I'm really happy. Really, really happy. When you were 5-1 up and he starts coming back at you, what are you thinking? Uh, I was a bit nervous. Yeah, I was a bit nervous because uh, when you're 5-1 up, you're, the only thing you're thinking is like one good leg. Only one good leg. It wasn't coming, wasn't coming. And it was 5 2, 5 3. I was like, oh, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> and then I was like, oh, happy. He misses his double. And then, yeah, I took my chance. So that was a good thing for me. We've seen on the Euro Tour for the last few weeks, your form is very indifferent. When you're good, you're very good. But then in the first, especially on the Friday, you seem to have these inconsistent games. Is that something you need to work on? Yeah, 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 definitely, definitely. Uh, I quit my job in January when I reached my tool card and I'm training now a lot every day, like three, four hours. And I want to, uh, for me, the biggest thing now is like, I know what I can. I know I can play games like this, but I don't want to play games like the Friday evening on the Euro Tours because the last couple of weeks, it wasn't good. And on that moment, it's for me, it's like, oh, time, what, what, what are you doing? Uh, so that's I'm really working hard on that. So uh, because I want to play my best game. Since winning your tour card, do you think you're now adjusting to life and settling into the PDC? Yeah, uh, I I knew when I went to Q school, uh, this was for me the good year. I went to Q school. I have my uh, advantage. I think like playing BDO tour three years uh, three years in a row and reaching the world finals and play on stage. So. You've got some baggage, um, and now in this moment, I'm I'm feeling like really okay on the on the pro tour, and I'm playing well. Uh, not all the times, but there's a, a lot of games uh, are going really well. So I'm really confident in what I'm doing, and I'm really happy with the game, with the with the way how it goes in this moment. Do you think the way Dutch starts is going, it's a good thing as well? Because you're all in this like mini rivalry, aren't you? All trying to get above each other in the pecking order as well. Yeah, there are a lot of good Dutch players and uh, you, want to be, you want to be one of the best from them. So uh, now I'm number 80 because I'm started this year, but you're always looking forward and forward and forward. Yeah, the, the, the first thing you want uh, when you're reach your, reaching your tool card is reaching the top 64 in two years. That's the main thing. But when I came in the PDC, for me, it was like, okay, the top 64 in two years. If I don't reach it, then it's just a shame because of me, because I know I have to, I have the game to be one of the players in the top 64. And I think more. That's the way I'm thinking. And then if, if, if I'm looking to the Dutch players in the top 32, like Jermaine, Jeffrey, uh, and all those players, they're playing well, but... I'm not thinking I'm, I'm, they're not better than me or, or so I can play their game also. So that's, that's the position what I want. And that's my goal. We've seen your A game is very good. If you can hook that up across the weekend, do you believe you can go on and win one of these tournaments? Always. I'm always believing in the winnings. Always. Um, I know when I play my best game and my preparation, everything is right. I know I can beat a lot of players because I already this year on the floor and in the Euro tours I play already a couple of uh, a beat already already a couple of good players so I know I can beat a lot of good players but it depends on the day because when your opponent uh, is throwing his best game you can lose and that's not a shame but you want to play always your best game and that's what I want that's just what I want I always want to play my best game Martin thank you very much and congratulations thank you thank you Martin, congratulations on the win tonight. You mentioned about quitting your job. Has that put a little bit more pressure on to get results and are you starting to relax a little bit more now? Yeah, I've worked like 36, 40 hours in a week and then you can train only in the evening. 
And the last couple of years in the BDO circuit, it was okay because uh, it was not your job. Uh, it was only a extra money. Uh, but now in the PDC, it's, it's just business. From the moment I came in at the first weekend, I saw it was just business. When somebody have to play me and he said, oh, he's not in this, this normal rhythm, he want to smash me. And in the BDO circuit, it's different. So I'm really happy that I can quit my work and now I can everything throw on the darts and, and, and train more than ever. And yeah, my game is better than ever. Do you think this week could be the start of something? Have you set yourself any targets between now and the end of the year? Yeah, for me, the, the first year was like, uh, a lot of people talk to me like the first year, just learn, just uh, watch and uh, see what happens. But for me, it's like the first year is the most important year when you, when you reach the tour card, because this is the start of your beginning. And when your beginning is good, you have an easy second year. And when you're starting bad, then the second year you have to play like your best game because otherwise you're losing your tool card. So for me, it was like my first year, I want to arrange everything like my first year has to be good because otherwise it's got maybe too much pressure on the second year and then you don't know what happens. So I'm really happy how it goes now. So yeah, happy days. <laughs> And, and just your thoughts on the next round, Devin Peterson, a player who's probably in the best form of his career right now. He is in good form, but I know um, when I'm in my good shape and my good form, I can beat a lot of players. So also Devin, I lost Devin uh, this year. So this, which, it's the same with Rob Ross. Just <laughs> take my revenge. <laughs> okay, brilliant. Thanks, Martin. Well played tonight. Thank you. Martin, you talk about being in the top 64 and having that good first year. Do you think it has been a good first year for you so far? Yeah, for so far. I lost some games where I'm thinking like it has to be better, but I'm, I've also won some couple of games against some really good players um, and where I'm really proud of. So um, I think on this moment when you're in your first year and you're standing here in the European Championships and the player championship finals are coming and the world championships are coming. I think you have a good year to reaching three uh, uh, major events in your first year. So, yeah, at the end, I think I'm playing a good year. With the way you've played over the last couple of months, is there, are there any eyes on the on the world championships? Obviously not too far away. Yeah. Um, I'm, yeah. The first thing is staying safe and not and not <laughs> testing positive on the COVID because that's in this time uh, it's a really weird time. But I know uh, for me the, the main thing was like I was playing the rules. Also last year when I played the rules in the BDO championships, it was for me I'm playing the rules. It's, it's a main stage and it's a main thing. And for me it was like this is it's an awesome tournament. But my main goal this year was reaching the world championships because that's the biggest tournament there is and I want to play that tournament. And I not only want to play it, I want to beat people. So, uh, yeah, 